Hey everyone, it's Wild Rage coming at you with some more Chaos Battle League. Hope everyone's day is going well. Mine is going good. It's the day after I made a video yesterday and I thought that I wouldn't have a chance to make another one. But you know what? I didn't have a lot of homework today so I thought, what the heck, I'm going to make another video. Because not only do I have another deck to showcase, I also have some great news. Some, finally, some amazing news. If you guys aren't on Discord, here it is from... Zishe. It says, hey, Chaos fam, we'll be releasing two new cards at the end of this month. The team's working really hard on getting the new characters in order while balancing some older cards and working on a solution to improve the matchmaking. We want to thank everyone that has remained positive since we have took o since we took over. We also really we are also really excited to see a lot of new players that have joined in the community and are climbing up the ranks fast. The community is growing and it's making us want to work hard. Harder. Thanks once again with a smiley face at the end because everyone wants a smiley face at the end. So there we go. That's from one of the, the, the nah, let me turn. That's from one of the developers, and we're hearing that two new characters. We don't know what it is yet. As soon as I know anything, I will let you guys know. I'm hoping maybe, maybe I'll be able to find out. Maybe like a day early or something, just so I can, just so I can get on the jump of it and let everybody know. But uh, yeah. You'll find out when I find out, or you'll find out before I find out. Who knows what's going to happen, but that's the way it is. But anyways, let's go ahead and get into the things. I don't remember. Let me, um, what was I going to, I was doing something. Oh, yes, on the videos yesterday, somebody mentioned that I should do a Shogun and Alchemist deck. Abir Thakur. Thakur? I don't know if I said that right. I probably butchered it, but try a Shogun Alchemist deck, and yeah. So I thought, what the heck? I'll try an Alchemist back deck. I was trying a different deck that Obi Wan sent me. I was liking it, but then I saw the Alchemist Shogun thing, so I went ahead and modified what he sent me into something a little bit different. And oh, it didn't swipe. There we go. There it is. As you see, we have the Shogun, the Van Helsing. Dracula, Cannonball, Bolt, Captain, the uh, Alchemist, and the Pharaoh with, I forgot to change that, with the Beam Turret and the Happily Ever After special. Now, as you see, my uh, I've only played this a couple times. I think I've only actually played it once today on my main account, and so I don't know if it's going to translate because as you see, my... Uh, my captain there is only a level 10, so I mean, it might not be as good on my uh, lower account here, but we're going to find out right now because we're going to go ahead and hop into a battle. Here we go. I want to thank you guys for watching, for tuning in, for subscribing, for liking, for commenting. It's all greatly appreciated. Tell you what, if you haven't hit that subscribe button, go ahead, take a moment right now, reach down, hit that button, and you too can be privy to all the latest and greatest from my channel. Here we go, playing Muddy Bunny from Lost Legions. And what are we going to do here? We'll go ahead, since I don't see the Shogun in... I don't see the Shogun in rotation right now. I'm just going to rotate some things around. I'm not going to... Okay, so I am going to worry about that a little bit. We'll go ahead and put that down there. Along with the Van Helsing, I guess. Just to back up the Dracula coming in and whatever comes out of that... Uh, present right here. I, I hope. Okay, so it's not going to be a uh, Shogun, which would have been really bad, but it's okay. So let's go ahead. We'll start the Alchemist, and hopefully, we can uh, pause long enough here. We're getting some decent damage done with that. We can get down the Al or the, the Shogun before the Alchemist. Come on, come on. Oh my goodness. Okay, so it didn't work. Unfortunately, that happened. But you know, live and learn. What what do you do? What do you do? We'll get ready for his push coming in here. He's going to play another present. Hopefully, okay, so no showdown, just a captain. And then we'll get ready with our pharaoh. And we'll get ready with our own captain here in just a second. We're going to do a, that right now just to distract and hopefully help take out the pharaoh up there. We'll play our Van Helsing over here just to uh, help take out the pharaoh. And then we're going to reset and just kind of let things uh, build back up, let our energy build back up, and hopefully get some things done. We're going to bolt the Martians. I'm not going to attack the UFO right now. I'm just going to let the Van Helsing do its thing. I'm going to play the Dracula right now, though, to distract the UFO. And then there it is. I was wondering when that was going to come. 
So now, okay, so this deck is going to be vulnerable, of course, to the Headless Horseman because, unfortunately, it doesn't have any buildings to stop, such as, like, Treasure Chest or, you know, something along that line. You could play that. I don't know. That wasn't... I don't know. I'm I, As I said yesterday, I'm not the biggest fan of, of the present. I think it's a... Uh, uh, I just don't think it's that great of a of a card. We'll play Shogun, and then over here we'll play the Van Helsing. We stop that there. He's gonna play the Spider there, but I don't know about that play. We're gonna go ahead and play our uh, Captain up here to help out with the Pharaoh, and we're gonna get some decent damage done on the main tower there. Now we just gotta worry about this uh, our second tower over here, because I imagine. He's going to bring out the Headless Horseman to just try to attack, which is going to be a bit of a problem, but as long as we're smart about it, we should be able to keep from being from it from taking our tower. Oh, but look at that. Look at that. Okay, so not enough. It's going to be really close. It's going to be really... They're going to take our first, our second tower there, so it's going to come down to this here, and what can we do? We're going to play our Shogun over here. Followed by our alchemist over here. Hopefully, it's out of range of the. Uh, it is out of. No, it's not out of range anymore. Darn it. Okay. So unfortunately, that didn't work as well as I had liked. We're gonna get that down there. If we could, we're not, we're not gonna get our happily ever after off either. All right. So we are in quite the pickle because all he has to do is play his uh, headless horseman once or twice, and he's gonna get the win, which is very unfortunate. But, unfortunately, there's not much we can do about it. So, but we'll do what we can. We're going to bolt just to give everything a pause there, not let it take us out. We'll take care of the Headless Horseman there. And it's looking like it's going to end in a tie just because we don't have anything. Maybe I need the wave in this instead of instead of the, uh, what do you call it, instead of the Happily Ever After. Well, anyways, that's a draw. Good game to Muddy Buddy from Lost Legions. And, yeah, I mean, okay, so, it didn't work. It didn't really work at all. I mean, we didn't lose trophies, but we didn't gain any trophies. What can we do to make this better? Okay, so, I guess I could put in the mummies instead of that. And then, should I use, I don't know, should I use the wave to try to wave it in if I need to. Let's go ahead, put the wave in, and give it another shot. Hopping back into battle. Look at that, no wait time. I don't really like it when there's no wait time. I really do. All right, here we go, playing Chisel Danger to something, 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 something. We're waiting for opponents, so we don't know. Chisel Danger 2134 from Spirit Warrior. We'll start with a Van Helsing in the back here. And uh, for lack of anything else, we'll just go ahead and start a Pharaoh in the back as well. Just kind of letting things go. Maybe they're not going to play anything. Should we? Should we? No? I don't, I don't know what's going on. Okay, so we're going to play the Shogun. Just because I don't know if this person is even playing. Maybe they timed out. Okay, so maybe they uh, glitched and weren't able to get a start, which is unfortunate. Oh, I could have sworn I had bolt. 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 There we go. Get rid of those. We are up a tower, but I think that's because they started late. I, I'm going to guess that they had a late start. Like, it didn't... Their connection wasn't the greatest or something. I don't know. But we'll start a Dracula. And we'll just go for the three here unless something just crazy happens. We'll go ahead. Oh, he's got the blob. He's got the blob. All right, so we'll go ahead and start the Van Helsing. And then we'll start the Pharaoh as well. We're going to cycle our mummies just because I don't... Don't really need it. We're gonna bolt all that there. We're gonna play the Shogun on this side over here. Just to help take out some of those things there. He's got the Trapper coming in, which is gonna be a bit of a problem. But, I mean, there's only so much that we can do. We should be able to take it out there pretty good. Unfortunately, we weren't able to take out his combination of the Blob and the, uh, what do you call it? 
the blob and the uh, pharaoh there. We're able to stop the damage though with the cannonball. They're mad, I know. Oh, well played. Thank you. Thank you. Very nice. Very nice. All right, so we got to be careful because that blob is going to be a problem for us. And here it comes again. We're going to start the Van Helsing. And we're going to kind of do the same thing. We're going to go ahead and start the Pharaoh. And then I'm going to cycle those. And then I'm going to put the uh, Dracula behind there on the Pharaoh. Just to try to help uh, shore up some of that stuff there. We're going to go ahead and cannonball. Which might be a bit of a danger. But, I mean, there's only so much we can do. And hopefully the alchemist, yes, the alchemist will come over there. We'll go ahead and do that with the bolt there. We need a bolt. Bolt, 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 bolt. Double bolt. And there we go. We were able to stop the push. Stop the push. And, yeah. We're going to get the win. But, like I said, I think it's because they started late. I don't know if I would have done that blob. Good game. Well played to Chisel Danger. We'll go ahead and say good game. And, yeah. Unfortunately, it doesn't look like they uh, got started right away. We did get the win, but I don't know if that worked either. That's the problem. I feel like, I mean, yeah, we've got the Shogun. But we need something. I mean, I guess I could do the Samurai. Mm, I don't want it to cost too much. I would like it to be something like three cost. That would be nice to have another tank. That's three cost. Speculations on what the cars might be. If you guys have any ideas, let me know in the comments below what you think they might be. And uh, I don't want to do Gunslinger. That seems too on the nose. So, you know what? We're going to go back to the captain and try that again. Now that we got the wave in there. Again, we didn't use the wave. We didn't need it, but uh, yeah. that's. We'll, we'll try the captain one more time with the wave this time instead of the half wave right after. And maybe, maybe we can get a clean win here instead of a draw and a late start win. Kiranex from Natural Born Killers. And yeah, we'll go ahead and start the uh, Pharaoh in the back once we get enough energy. Unless they play something first and then I'll play something else maybe but uh okay playing the pharaoh he's playing oh look at that level nine with a level eight that's something all right we'll go ahead and we'll start a dracula and we'll get ready with our uh we'll get ready with our captain right now and our own alchemist on this side over here and we should be able to with the combination of the dracula and the alchemist we should be able to that we were we were able to take out his alchemist but we didn't get a lot of damage done on the other side there. We will get some damage done here. And I don't know about the assassin play there. I don't know that that was the best of ideas because the assassin wasn't going to do anything. But, you know, I mean, this is what it is. We got that coming in here. We're going to get ready with our bolt right now to bolt all them. And then we'll play our shogun up here to help deal with the, uh, to help deal with the blob. That's what we want. We need to, uh, the Martians aren't going to be able to take us out in time. We'll be able to take out the Blob. He's going to play the Barrel, which will do a little bit, but our Pharaoh should come in there. And he's going to get an Assassin going, which is probably going to take out our Shogun. Oh no, it took out one of the Mummies instead. That, that hurts. That hurts. So the Mummy was able to get ahead of the Shogun there just enough that then he, uh went ahead and scored or the assassin killed the mummy instead which is why it's nice to have the pharaoh or mummies for that matter with the uh with the shogun because it can be distracting if you don't have bolt and rotation to stop her or a cannonball the bat swarm versus the dracula of course is going to lose every single time we're gonna do we'll do the captain and we'll do the van helsing over here and then we'll start a Pharaoh over here just to help deal with whatever they're going to play over on this side, which I imagine is going to be a blob at some point. I don't know when that's going to be, but I know the blob is coming. So they're going to do a blob on the other side, actually. And it's actually going to be out of range of their tower, so the tower's not going to help. We'll go ahead and start our uh, Shogun there. We'll put an Alchemist in the back. We're going to put our Captain in front of the shogun there so that way the assassin takes out the uh what do you call it? the captain instead of the shogun we're gonna wave everything over to this side over here it's not gonna do that much but 
We were able to stop their push, and we're going to get some decent damage done on their tower there. Again, the Bat Swarm versus Dracula, not a good matchup. I don't know, with the meta the way it is right now, I've seen a bunch of people using bats, either the two cost bats or the bat swarm. And right now with Shogun cost, or I'm sorry, with the Alchemist costing four and Dracula still being out and around there, it's just not worth it to play. Um, it's not worth it to play the bats. It just, I don't think it is. I mean, maybe you can get it to work better than I could. But anyway, good game to cure next from Natural Born Killers. One star victory, not bad, not bad. I don't know. It was a better game. But you know what? <coughs> oh, excuse me. We should do one more just to be, let's call it, be safe, be sure, whatever it is. Let's do one more. Then we'll call it a day. And yeah, jumping right back into battle. I'm liking this. Oh, we're playing Chisel Danger again. That's unfortunate because... Well, not because I don't want to face him again, because they had that timeout issue last time, but because I've already faced him. So, but we did switch. So, I mean, there's that. Hopefully, they're able to get into the battle on time. We'll go ahead and start an alchemist in the back there. We'll give him a thumbs up. The alchemist. And then we'll go ahead and start the captain in front there. With the alchemist in front. Just to soar up any of that. We're going to go ahead and bolt those guys there. And I'm gonna put the Van Helsing over here to help deal with the uh, to help deal with the Tin Man there. He's got those coming in, but I'm gonna play my Dracula along with my Pharaoh, so that way we can go ahead and take care of those. He does have what is that? That is the Gunslinger on the other side there, which can be a bit of a problem. But we're gonna get ready with our Cannonball right now just to at least take her out. I mean. It would have been nice if he played something else. Unfortunately, he didn't. So, I mean, we weren't able to get all that much value out of it. But, you know, we'll go ahead and start the Alchemist. And I don't think I'm going to start anything else. I'm just going to do the Alchemist because the Alchemist plus our Beam Tower will be able to take out the uh, the Axe. The Tin Man. The Tin Man. There we go. We'll start a Van Helsing in the back here just to uh, get another push going. I don't know what... Okay, so he's going to play... There's the blob. That's what I've been waiting for. I've been waiting for the blob. And I think... I think we played a blob on the last one there. So I'm going to start a captain here in the back. And he's got those coming in there. So we need... What do we need? We need the pharaoh. And right as they cross the bridge... Right as they cross the bridge... I'm going to play the uh, Dracula on the pistol ears and on the uh, pharaoh there. We'll do some decent damage. They were able to get quite a bit of damage done to our tower, though, with that uh, hunter push, or the trapper, rather. I always call it the, the hunter. I don't know why I call it the hunter, but I call it the hunter. We're going to start a Van Helsing over here, just to uh, kind of help with that. The, okay, so it's not going to quite take out, unfortunately, not going to take out the gunslinger, but it should only get one shot off. It's not even going to get one shot off. We're going to play that, and we'll play the captain over here just to distract the... Uh, the Tin Man. Let's go ahead and bolt them down. And then I'm going to play the Dracula here just to uh, kind of distract and maybe keep our uh, Pharaoh alive for a little bit there. It is going to be a bit of a time dealing with that Axeman because the Axeman, of course, is very, very weak to the. Or I'm sorry, the Pharaoh is weak towards the Axe. Okay. Oh, what do we do? What do we do? What do we do? I think I'm going to go ahead and play the cannonball there just because... Oh, I didn't know that was coming. But, uh, yeah, I wanted to get that out of the way there. We'll get our bolt ready just in case. Yeah, we'll play bolt. Unfortunately, it's not going to do a whole lot, but we will be getting close to taking out the uh, Tin Man there, which is good. We'll go ahead and play our Dracula up here. We'll play our Van Helsing on the other side here. It's not going to work out. I didn't actually need the Van Helsing to help, but uh, yeah. Go ahead and play that there. We're going to go ahead and play our Cannonball and get the Pharaoh and the uh, the Pharaoh and the Gunslinger. Plus, we'll be able to do that. We'll go ahead and get our, we'll get our, uh, what do you call it, our Captain down there, hopefully to help stop some of the damage from that. No, no, we're going to get a bunch of damage done from that trapper there that is unfortunate we're gonna go ahead and start our start that there have they played nope there's their special so now we just need to get our shogun 
Okay, so now we're gonna go and play Drac. Oh, it's over. Draw. Okay, good game. To, uh, good game to Chisel Danger. Two, one, three, four. I ran out of time. I was too busy defending. I, I should have, uh, I don't know. I don't know. Oh, well, I didn't get enough epic cards, so that means I have to play one more, right? Right. That's that's what it means. So unfortunately, the blob seems to be the weakness. The wave would have worked, but I was like, I was afraid that they were gonna have something like the black hole, which would have negated my shogun, and I would have put him up on elixir. And you know, sometimes it's better to play for the draw than it is to play for the win. Sometimes, well, you know, it's better to draw than it is to lose. And I think, I think personally, if I'd have used the wave on the Shogun at that time when I almost did it, that I would have lost. Because they would have been up on Elixir. But anyways, Cappy11 from Spain won. We'll go ahead and start a Pharaoh here in the back. Along with a Van Helsing. And I mean, we'll go ahead and start the Shogun too. Since they don't seem to be playing anything. Maybe it's another timeout issue. I don't know. We will uh, see. Okay, so yeah, I think they must have disconnected or something because there's no way I should be just plowing through <laughs> their defenses like that. Like, I think that's going to be it. I think that's going to be the game. Like, 100%, I don't think it's going to be able to stop. Yeah, that's unfortunate. That's unfortunate that, uh, yeah, I'm pretty sure that was a disconnect. But, I mean, it's a win for us. So, there's something out of that. And I think this deck has potential. I don't know. Maybe it needs a little more tweaking. It was, like I said, it was working well. What? what? You guys see this, right? I played an Epic. I played the Shogun. I played the Pharaoh. But, uh, no, no, uh, no toaster. I wonder what's up with that. Okay. Okay. Alright guys, so bear with me. This is going to be an extra long one. I want that epic thing there. Is that? No, still didn't do it. So, we're going back into the battle. Screw it. Six battles in a, in a video. I mean, sorry, it's long. I know you guys can fast forward, but if you're watching this and, you're, and I'm telling you to fast forward now, then it's probably too late for you. You've already been sucked in. So you might as well stick around for the last, for the last fight. And hopefully it'll be a win. I mean, hopefully, because so far it's been draws and wins and Nimrod. I feel like I recognize that name. I don't. Puessence X. Okay. Nimrod. We'll go ahead and start our Dracula here in the back. And we'll go ahead and start our Pharaoh in the back here. We're going to get ready with the Cannonball just in case they play anything else. Other. Okay, so they played a... A Minotaur. That is unfortunate. So we'll play that there. Oh my goodness, this guy just has some levels. Has some levels, they do. It's okay. That's okay. We're gonna make this work. We're gonna make this work. We were able to stop almost all the damage being done. Go ahead and play the Alchemist here. I don't know if we're gonna be able to uh, stop. Oof. Oof. Yeah, that's painful. Very, very painful. We need to get our Dracula down just to. Uh, save some face there okay so i mean it could have been a lot worse they could have got a lot more damage done to us but uh thankfully we are able to stop most of it i mean that barrel is going to do what the barrel does but look at that we get two shots off with the alchemist and it puts us ahead so yay for us we will go ahead and start the pharaoh in the back again okay so we got to be on the watch out for the barrel and what else was there i don't even remember what else there was now and i remember it in my head oh that's right the minotaur Go ahead and play the Captain. And we'll play the Van Helsing. And we'll go ahead and play the Bolt. And we'll play the Cannonball. To help take that out. And it's not going to be... We, well, we'll get close to taking out the, uh, the Dracula there, but it wasn't quite enough. And we'll, uh, we'll take a little bit of damage. But we do have this tower down to... 1635 he's yet to see our shogun so hopefully we can get that shogun going here quickly we'll go ahead and play the uh pharaoh and then right as they attack that we'll go ahead and play the captain we will get some damage unfortunately from that uh what do you call it from the trapper but uh there's not much you can do about that 
We got a Dracula going in there, but it's all by itself against a uh, level 3 Dracula, so we're going to lose that battle. But I think it's time to bring out the... I don't know how he got back to his... How did he get back to his uh, Minotaur so quickly? That was really quick. I mean, he must have... He had to have cycled back to it, but I don't... I didn't see it, but, uh, you know, it is what it is. He's not going to get anything done with that there. We're going to go ahead and cannonball the uh, Boya there just to stop it from doing any damage. He is going to get... Uh, He's going to get that barrel in on us, but we should get at least one. Nope, we're not going to get any shots off. We'll go ahead and play that, and we'll play the captain. Yeah, I'm not understanding how he's cycling quite as fast as he is, but uh, he's certainly cycling. Let me give him that. Cycle, cycle, cycle. And I don't think they've used their uh, special yet. We will get some damage from the, uh, what do you call it? From that. So we'll go ahead and play our uh, pharaoh. We'll play our Shogun. It's not going to be quite enough. We're going to go ahead and just hit the wave for the heck of it. Just to uh, kind of get everything back. We'll get a little bit of shots done with the uh, with the Pharaoh there. I don't know, guys. I don't think we're going to win this one. I don't know that. Need a bolt. Hopefully, yeah, I won't get there in time to do anything. And then we need to play the Pharaoh. Because the... Uh, the, uh, well, that's coming in. And, oof, oof. I don't know, guys. I don't know. We need to hold on for 10 seconds. Because their levels are up higher than us all around. But that's all right. That's the name of the game. And sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't work. We need to... Okay, we held on for the draw. So, all in all, a fairly disappointing video, in my opinion. I mean, it did show the deck, blah, 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 blah. But we didn't get the wins that I wanted. Hey, but we got, uh, we only had to pay, play two games to get that one epic card. It's a little weird, but uh, let's go ahead and open up that. What do we get? We get 1266 in gold. We get some Buccaneers, some Shuriken, some Oni, Energy Generator. Okay, so decent. You know, I might put the uh, ninjas in for the. Ninjas in there for the captain. I think that might work decent. I don't know. Something was missing. I wasn't able to quite get the wins that I wanted. But you know what? We still had fun. Didn't we? What do we have? We have a draw, a win, a draw, a win, a win, and a draw. So, yeah. Not bad. Not bad. I mean, it wasn't the greatest. It wasn't the worst. It is what it is. Take it for what you want. There's a look at the deck one more time. Beam Tour, Tidal Wave, Shogun, Dracula, Bolt, Alchemist, Van Helsing, Cannonball, Captain, and, of course, the Pharaoh. And, yeah, like I said, I think I might try here soon the uh, Ninjas instead of the Captain. That might work. Let me know if you have any ideas on what could be changed and what could be different. Uh, yeah, hit me up on Discord, Wild Rage 1004 and one last time, guys, I want to thank you for sticking around, for watching, for liking, for subscribing. If you're still here, hit that you're still here. Let me know. Late, late video squad. That's what we're going to be. And yeah, until next time, everybody, this is Wild Rage saying peace out and keep up the chaos.